Hello and welcome to a hopefully much better than last week's episode of What Did He Hell. We are playing Basic Tax Law, starring Barky Budget, Dog Auditor. Uh, I think I'm ready for this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Barky Budget, Dog Auditor. I'm here to teach you all about Basic Tax Law. Should help you better understand how School to file your federal work. income taxes. For sure. I just like that someone's taking still images, like really high quality still images of this dog, and like, that's so good. Pass all six quizzes for a bonus scene. So which lesson that's, do you that's want? That's the secret hentai scene, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I need less of that here. Filing status. When you're filling out your form oh. 1040, the first thing you need to do is select a filing status. There are five filing statuses to choose from. Single married, filed jointly, blah. Married filing jointly, married filing separately, qualifying widow Ur. with dependent child and head of household. Figure out which status you are. We look at the last day of the year, which is December 31st. Let me discuss all five statuses. Mm. <laughs> uh, single. Yep. Yeah. Married. Yep. Yeah. Uh-huh. I thought there'd be different picture for each status. I'm disappointed. Look, <laughs> man. We can't blow our whole load here. <laughs> I only have so many pictures of this dog. We have six lessons to get through. <laughs> These aren't complicated. Well, no. Taxes we're really not. Are. We're not there yet. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Everyone's following along, right? Okay, good. Uh-huh. Yep. Sure. Uh-oh. Yeah. My owner is a lonely woman who lives by herself and has never been married. She considers me to be her only child. Her filing status is... Single. Since I'm a great dog auditor, though, I pay more than half her of her expenses. Next question. Tabitha's divorce was finalized in August. She has sole custody of their four-year-old chi four child who lived with her the entire year. She paid more than half the cost of keeping up the home. Tabitha's filing status is... She was married for most of the year, so she's still married, so probably married filing separately. Or she could have been... Had Wrong. Ah, uh, she... Not married or a widow. Damn it. thought I got that sentence right while you were blowing through. <laughs> <laughs> Weird. So, we're all hoping that this person owns this dog, and it's not just, hey, there's a lot of pictures of this dog on the no, stock image site. probably bought these images from the stock image site. <laughs> Nancy's husband died ten years ago, leaving her to raise their three-year-old child by herself. The child lives with her, and she pays all its expenses. Her filing status is... Was, the, was there a year widower. for qualifying widower? I think there was... Uh, hmm. Should have studied. <laughs> Should have studied, but the dog was distracted. Pull the trigger. <laughs> Since her husband died more than two years ago. Okay, it looks like you didn't answer all three questions. Let's quest just retake the quiz. Shins. Retake it? Yeah. Okay. We can do this. I have a comment. She's single. She's single. This bitch is out of household. I think that Single. woman, she's also head of household. That's true, head of household. Yeah, all right, there we go. Wait, I'm on my way to being a great dog auditor like him? Are, is this a quiz for dogs? Am I turning into a dog as right? I answer these questions? Conceptions, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Personal dependency, personal is the easy one, blah, 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 blah. Uh-huh. I have so many people I want to gift this to. <laughs> <laughs> Do we? Now, was this on Steam? No! Really? Yep. The actual helpful, cute thing with positive emotions isn't on Steam, it's on itch.io. Like, w w whenever people start talking about all, all the good games can do in the world... Yeah. I'm gonna think of this. Yeah, no. Unless this goes psychotic at some point in the middle which, of it. This which is what I'm waiting for. <laughs> Damn. But not this 
adorable ducks on to lead us astray. <laughs> Parking Pudgy wouldn't do that to us. Parking Pudgy, it's awesome. Uh huh. Yep. Yep. Uh huh. Do you think they test it? Yeah, they test us completely at the end of each part, but there's no like mega quiz, is there? I don't know. I don't. Yeah. I didn't hear anything about that, and I didn't see anything in the options. Because there's only the six lessons. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm trying to read here, but the dog just keeps <laughs> popping up up there, and I'm like, oh, look at the dog. I want to click to see more dog images, but then there's text, and I'm skipping it, and it's important <laughs> text. We got this one. Blow through it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We'll These fine. are words. I've seen them before. Yeah. We've looked Whoa. at taxes. Uh-huh. Yeah, no. I've filed taxes. Yeah. I'm clearly every use case. Yes, everyone. <laughs> no. Cool. Simple question. My owner considers me to be the child she never had. She pays all my expenses and I lived with no, her all year. because you're a dog. <laughs> I mean, that's the way I want to go. Is this game gonna go that way? I'm pretty sure this game's gonna go that way. Yeah. That's great. <laughs> Absolutely. Barky here does not fuck around with tax law. <laughs> I mean, professional dog auditor. Julia lives with her daughter, D daughter Donna and Donna's daughter, Kimberly. Julia pays all their expenses. Who well, can claim Julia Kimberly can. as a dependent? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Peter's 20 years old and single. He lived with his parents all year, but they told him they won't claim him on their return. He does not provide more than half of his support. I think technically we're supposed to go with the second one. Hmm. Whoa. See? T told you we had this one. Yeah, <laughs> you were right. But go to lesson six. We've already discussed every type of tax, right? Sorry to burst your bubble, but there are other taxes which are determined separately. First is the self-employment tax. You have to pay this if your self-employment income is $400 or more. Hey, this is the same picture of that dog. I'm on to them. <laughs> but it emotionally fits the scene. Church employee income does not count as self-employment income, but you still have to pay the self-employee tax if your church employee income is $108.28 or more. That's a very specific number. <laughs> it is. Schedule SE to find out what your self-employment tax is, and don't forget, half of this tax counts as an adjustment to income. Next, unreported Social Security and Medicare tax, or as I like to call it, the tip tax. You got more than $20 in tips in one month, you must report it to... <laughs> Yeah, that happens all the time. Yeah, that's our GDP is completely Weird. correctly adjusted for that. However, sometimes tips aren't reported on the W-2 because the employee forgot about them. The employer decided to allocate them or for some other reason, which means you've got unreported tip income. You'll use Form 4137 to figure out how much that's of exactly the unreported tip to yes, go to taxes. Definitely doing that. Right. Everything else in this section is advanced tax law. You don't have to know these things for basic tax law, but I'll mention them anyways for the sake of completion. It sounds like shit we don't need to know. No. I think we got this one too. We're good. We know about... What? Did you just blow through a question? Joe man, no, 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 It wasn't reported on his W-2 days, so you have to. In five no. months now. Doesn't want to pay 415 in taxes on 415? What's her best option? Pay your taxes. Pay your taxes. Correct. You should always pay your taxes. I like this dog. Yes, I want to retake the quiz because I answered the first thing wrong. Fancy Francie Drew? Drew? <laughs> no. Wait, uh, it's yeah. over 400. Yeah, so I was yes. like, it's... Sorry, I thought it was 600. I wonder how old this game is. Mm -hmm. No. They are Texas. Because I'm the law. Good job. 
All right. So yeah, like that's... we have to complete all of these. Do we? So because I, th I think there. that was the yeah, the goodbye the... message there, right? Well, it it actually says when that at the end. Twelve through fourteen of the ten forty are all advanced tax law, not basic law. Do you want to know? What section are we in? The third income. Oh. For two months, the money she got from them is income. Social Security last year, this counts as Social, Social Security, Security benefits? benefits? Whoa. <laughs> that was a hard one. We're so good at Court this. Or paid Luna alimony. This is alimony. alimony. Wow. Oh, we are fucking rocking and rolling. We are so incredibly good at this. Adjusted gross income. <laughs> Would you like to hear? No, I wouldn't. This is basic. We are tax, tax masters. <laughs> I should be doing everyone's taxes. I'm so good. I think we beat taxes. Don't have to pay them anymore. Paul and Lisa moved to California in September. A trip that they paid three thousand dollars for a movie truck, two thousand for hotels, nine hundred dollars in gas, and three hundred fifty dollars in meals. Fifty-nine You don't think meals are covered? No. Yes! Good job. <laughs> We're selling states to must pay $1,300 a year plus all- Oh, plus ongoing medical expenses. So medical expenses over $1,200. I just- So you can buy them? Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> They seem way harder than they actually are, like I worry about- I, I think the first ones were harder. We just fucked them up. My order paid 2300 and qualified student. Zero? Yeah, zero. Uh, uh. Or 2500, whichever uh. is smaller. Okay. okay, so we got this. We got it this time. 59. Uh, 59. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yep, yep. Uh, uh huh. Twenty five hundred. Uh huh. And then twenty five hundred okay. because it said twenty three hundred or twenty five. Whichever is greater. Yeah. What? Oh, what? Smaller. Uh, well, smaller. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, we are bad at reading. <laughs> oh man. We are good at taxes, but we are bad at reading. <laughs> that could really come to screw us. I feel. But mostly in taxes. Where's Wesley Snipes when you need him? <laughs> okay, we got one more. Okay. Taxes and credits is. I don't think they're gonna do anything when we do this. Would you like to hear them? No. Never. Not have time for advanced tax law. We're here for basic tax law. Something and about- dog pictures, but... Nope. <laughs> okay, Joey B can take the standard deduction of $12,600. When he itemizes his deductions, he gets $12,500. Should he itemize or take the standard deduction? Take the standard deduction. Correct, he should. Sasha paid $2,000 to take a class at the local community college, and she qualifies for an educational credit. Which one is it? The American Opportunity Credit or the Lifelong Learning Credit? The Lifelong Learning life Credit. Life Correct! <laughs> Zero, because you're a dog! <laughs> and there's lots of these <laughs> I like dog questions. And I'm, I'm not, not a, a child. child! Yes, correct. Hell yeah, Barky Budget. There we go, we got all six quizzes correct. That means you unlocked a bonus, bonus scene. scene. Whoa. The scene is a mini mystery called called Carlton Drew and the Power Stock Scheme. I hope you enjoy it. By the way, this music's music from a library we've pulled things Course. from before. I think it was a uh, our pitch video to E-Empire, whatever. Here we go. <laughs> wow. This is slightly different. I was wondering where that letter was. I have stock in that company, and the record date for this quarter was two weeks ago. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> I'm getting dividends as a shareholder for Pacific Power Plus. I still don't know what that means. <laughs> in simple terms, it means they're paying me $50 as thanks for investing in their company. Here, let me show you exactly what the letter says. Reads letter. What are the- They're only paying me $49.90 this quarter. What's wrong? I should be getting $50. You lost a dime. Big deal. Wait a minute, this dividend yield on the stock has been adjusted! Something is clearly amiss here. You getting fucked, Carlton. <laughs> the stock has gone up by 0.73%, the dividend yield has gone down by 0.2%. Something's not right here, I'm going to call the Securities and Exchanges Commission. Dad, you're totally overreacting. I'm not. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Fancy, it is the principle of the thing. Ten months later. Hey Dad, here's the mail. <laughs> 
Just one letter for you. Good news, Francie. Remember that power company with the bogus stock returns? No. <laughs> Thanks care. for my tip, the Securities and Exchange Commission was able to... was able to the fraudulent elements and eliminate them before any more false reports are given to the public. The company is now being audited to ensure its financial stability. Fucking you get thought, it, Carlton. You were the only detective in this household. Ah, your old man could cast criminals too, you know. The government has even given me a reward for whistleblowing on this scheme. How much? It's $40. <laughs> That's less than I was getting for the phony dividends. No, no! Whatever, Dad. The end. Fancy <laughs> hey, Drew don't give a shit. <laughs> that was incredible. I feel we all learned today and grew as individuals. Can I click on the dog and... No. No? No. You need to read tax forms to see more pictures of the dog. <laughs> it's tragic. Credit. I'm sure this is one person. Ooh. Okay, Pixabay. Yep. <laughs> I'm glad this is in the world. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is awesome. This almost makes up for last week. Almost. But nothing can, really. The episode of What Any Hell we're referring to will never be uploaded. That episode was so damn awful. This video was brought to you by the incredible generosity of our executive producer, Vincent Poverk. Go to patreon.com and become a Vincent Poverk today.